Hey, Palaya. So today we are going to do a video about Dungeon Worlds, and I'm gonna tell you how exactly how much I made in five days. Now, before we start, hit the like, subscribe if you're new here, and let's get into it. This channel is all about crypto and crypto games. So let's start with some information about Dungeon Worlds, which is something that you guys requested and I'm going to provide it, at least what I know, okay? So Dungeon Worlds will have four stages, which are going to be mining, which we already are in that stage. So you basically need a character, doesn't, doesn't matter what rarity, obviously it matters with the power, but you need a character and a land so like you can see right here we have a character and a land which in turn gave 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 gives us uranium or whatever is on that land now this adds up every single second i think and gives you a total whenever you click on it you can click once a day you can click however often you want from what I've seen doesn't make much of a difference as you can see it stacks up every single second or however it's a short time basically not not a long time at all second would be leveling up so as you can see I have a level 1 character right here and has the power of 10 now I don't know how much uh, level would add up to my power but it's definitely going to get stronger but to do that you will have to unstake this character and use it for level up so you can't do both things at the same time so that's the only inconvenience in that <laughs> right so leveling up and from what I understand in the future you will need the uh, one but warriors for that as well and the third is breathing now you will be needing uh, characters from the same rarities and you you will have a cooling time until they will breathe and then again a cooling time until they can breathe again and so on so forth is going to get longer every time you breed and um, baby that's going to come out from that is going to be able to get a rarity up their parents or down or even the same but it's going to be a roller coaster there's a big chance you will get a smaller rarity or whatever you know so that's a risk there and the last but not the least is multiple dungeon because that's why it says dungeon worlds now you'll be able to create your own dungeon your own rules supposedly it's not really from what i understand we're going to talk about it in a second <laughs> you're going to need nine lands that are going to have to be in the same coordinates from what i understood and then you can mine you know what is on that land basically but you again you will need a land and a character so you can come with a koal land and a character on my lands and my dungeon and you will be able to mine uranium or gold if i so choose so we'll see we'll see what's uh what's more profitable and if people want it, we'll see. <coughs> now let's talk about that, yeah? Um, when this idea was implemented, they were saying uh, you will be able to do whatever you want with your dungeon. That was like, you know, the commercial basically. And now, from what I understand, I will have a limit of players per patch of land and what really annoying to me is that 
we were hoping to get on polygon blockchain is but we don't hear nothing about it but we hear instead that we are going to maybe renounce eos blockchain at least on dungeon walls so i was going to get a big difference between dungeon master and dungeon worlds because you can stake 200 nfts here and you can stake 100 nfts there basically uh i don't like this idea at all they said that it's going to be much more complicated so that's why but i see this as not cool at all because it was complicated me working for that money as well so i'm just saying you know i was promised something as what a lot of people are feeling believe me if they are not gonna get that it's going to sting sting a couple of people and yeah now if you want to invest i don't know that's on you i'm not a financial advisor or nothing um I just buy to get some NFTs and have some fun along the way, you know. And obviously I'm creating NFTs as well. So it's on you. Uh, is it a good choice for you to get some uranium, get some gold, make some trades, you know? Are you going to get that value back? I don't know. right now the markets are really really low and with for obvious reasons but i can't say nothing about it so basically in five days we did eight gold something like that and i would say because i just claimed 16 max every single day something like that you can do the math right there i think it's pretty cool 16 max every single day and basically one and some gold every single day it adds up you know and it's cool it's cool i have gold let's go <laughs> um what's not what's something i don't like about this is that the totally different i see they're not combined dungeon master and dungeon walls i do hope is going to get at that point and maybe stop thinking about not including us <laughs> thank you please because i um, definitely bought the lands with the idea that i can you know use cursed panda and for the pain meds maybe even polygon at uh, some point you know so yeah i sure hope but it don't, don't doesn't seem that way and it's not cool it's not cool that's not cool but there you go so expect around one gold every single day if you have a gold land and there you go maybe do not rush into buying characters common characters maybe you can claim one for free later i know it's not that expensive but even so if you don't have that crypto you know you might want to hold on okay players i hope i helped you guys with some of the questions that you had please leave a like subscribe and leave a comment with any kind of question that you have I'm more than happy to has answer it or maybe even make a video about it like this one. Have a good one player and good luck in the chest later.